Please don't try this at home. You should listen to us. We're kind of a big deal. <gasps> Hello and welcome to, is it a good idea to microwave this? I'm your host, Jory Karen. Jory, are you doing that stupid microwave show again? I told you, you need to get your hair redone, you need to get to a new channel, do your own thing. You just turned into Chinese? Mm-hmm, your hair looks good like this. With Tresemme. Ooh la la. <sighs> It smells like victory! All hands to the deck. Nobody likes roasted nuts. <laughs> you got that on camera, right? I don't trust this bitch. Are you out of your mind? The masks, they do nothing! You totally could have died. You put a shield at three words! Stopping, stopping! Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory Karen Microwave Laboratory 3.5, safety is our number one concern. And that's why we hide behind this giant tinfoil shield to protect our nuts. Because our doesn't, nuts are important do, to us. It doesn't do anything. It's not a lie. It doesn't do anything. And there's fans. <laughs> Stupid. They do. After 290 something, something episodes, let's, let's be frank. This is, it, yeah. It's bullshit. Well, that, yeah. It's a placebo. Look at that microwave over there. We, Emily, right? Emily. Yeah. Emily. Emily. Uh, we're going to be microwaving this aerosol can dipped in oil because oil gets hotter faster. I'm thinking if we heat up the thing, it'll boom. And that's what we really want. We want that to burst and then hot oil just to fly just everywhere. And just everywhere. Ah! I'm going to tape that up a little bit too. because Why? Because I realized as we were doing this that flaming hot oil is not good. That's stupid. Don't worry. I'll add a little bit so it can still fly out and burn something. How long should we put it in there for? $9.99. Let's retreat to safety, fellas. No. All right, so predictions, fellas. We've done aerosols before, but never in a vat of super hot oil. Magma. <laughs> so what do you think will actually happen here? Boom, big boom. Oil. <clears throat> Aerosol. What happens? Find out in seven minutes. Aerosol? More like Harry Ball. <laughs> it took me that long to come up with that. Have we seen any signs that this is actually going to do anything? Or? I can't even tell. Then again, you. if it slowly exploded, I'd be really pissed. So I'm glad we haven't seen any signs yet. It's that shock. Whoa! Like that one. <laughs> that one. <laughs> there you go. That blew the Whoa. tape off. <laughs> Heart skipped a beat there, fellas. Yeah. Oh, wow. Huh. All right, guys, what happened? Wow. Well, the it tape. Smells like, it smells like hairspray down it, here. It broke. Oh, my God. Oh, it broke that thick, plastic, beefy <laughs> container. I thought Tupperware was supposed to be like Nalgene, indestructible. What the heck is all this jizz here? Is this the oil? It's extreme hold. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. It's there's something about Mary. Uh, now there's oil it's everywhere. Yeah, where is? Yeah, where is the aerosol container itself, guys? Okay, well, if the cover, and then we'll keep keep searching. We're gonna find it in my yard like three months later. Let's turn this over there just so we can see. Yeah, please. Jory, have you found it in all that June snow out there? No. It's actually not snow, John. It's soap. In the showbiz, we use soap instead of snow. So where's the aerosol can itself, dude? We should have put a tracking device on it. <laughs> okay, it would have mass, so even if it hit the hill, I'm guessing it would roll back down, right? Found it. I'm Jory Karen, and I'm live from underneath the Jory Karen Microwave Laboratory 3.5. We have found the recently exploded aerosol can. Luckily, it did not break the house because the tinfoil shield protected the house. Good work, Jory. Now let's come back up above ground and finish this episode. Uh, <laughs> sucks being this tall. <laughs> There's 10 feet of clearance here. So you may be wondering, is it a good idea to put an aerosol can in oil. And then microwave And it. then microwave Why would anyone Hell wonder yeah. that? There's like a string of events that anyone no, no, would have to go no. through and no sane person would. Think about this. Someone's like, oh, I'm gonna spray my hair down with aerosol. Oh, it's so cold. I don't know if it actually well, retains what are you, what are you, cold. What you, like, a cold oh, day? Oh, I should microwave it to warm it up. And you're not gonna put it in water, because... <laughs> well, that's about all the time we have for... Is, Is it a good idea to microwave, microwave this? this? I'm your host, Jerry Carrot. I'm your psychic, Brian McCallion. Chinese and Spanish. <laughs> yeah, he was like, You'd be surprised. I'm just gonna do your hair, and then we're going to go. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be surprised what we find in Lynn, huh?